Hi guys, it's that time of the day again. <laughs> You're gonna be sick of me by the 24th. Um, and I'm gonna open the advents. It will be followed by my Lakira video, which I did yesterday. <laughs> I have to say, <laughs> it wasn't great. Um, not quite as bad <laughs> as the next one I did, which you will see in a few days. <laughs> I'm still recovering from that one. But before I do this, I just wanted to say I had some Christmas cards, which is so lovely. Um, I had one from, Sh I'm not going to read out what they say because they're special, but I've had one from Sharan. Um, I've had one from Catherine. Uh, I've had one from um, Helen. <clears throat> and I even had a little gift, which is so sweet, but you really don't need to ever send me gifts or anything. But a really lovely writing set. Would you look at that? with a horse and a donkey on it, so love it. And such a pretty little pouch. I haven't decided what I'm gonna use it for, but I tell you what I was thinking about was, I do have a glasses tin, but it's a bit of a nuisance in some of my bags. So I was thinking, <laughs> if I ever get in the habit, but to carry some spare glasses in my bag, it's padded, so it'll protect them which would be really nice. So I just want to say thank you so much, but you really don't need to send me presents. That was so sweet. Um, and thank you for the Christmas cards as well. Lovely of you. Anyway, let's get on to the advent. As always, I'm starting with Mac. I think you've realised by now, this is the one that excites me the most, even though I get more expensive things from the other ones. There's just something about makeup. I love makeup. I love playing with makeup. Um, so today is the 15th. So here we go love playing with it not very really good at it but i do love it 15 wrapped up oh it's a lippy it's called oh ruby woo this is the red that i mentioned originally this was the red that i used to wear whether i can carry it off now i don't know but i love ruby woo and what i love is when you get one of these little little they'll go in the tiniest little handbag or, or or whatever for parties and things when i used to go to buy <laughs> when i used to have a life um so i'm really pleased with that that is such a blast from the past ruby woo i may have to wear it christmas day <laughs> it's the 15th from space nk things are bedlam here the children are generally poorly now but it, it's a sickness bug um it's <laughs> they're walking around with their little bowls saying do you know what this is for grandma and i'm like oh yes i know i know of old and unfortunately my daughter doesn't feel very well either so she's struggling on god bless her she's struggling on and i'm sat in here being spoiled so hey ho oh dermalogica special cleansing gel by dermalogica but a few pre not recently but in years gone oh and inside there were two little samples one is a pre-cleanse and one is a daily microfoliant um what is a pre-cleanse surely that's just your first cleanse isn't it deep cleansing oil yeah so your first cleanse so it's an oil so if you do the two cleanses of an oil and then like a gel or a cream or something like that that's the pre-cleanse that's the microfoliant and then this is the special cleansing gel now what makes it special it's soap free it's a foaming gel and it cleanses all skin conditions um i'm really happy with the uh, oil that i use at the moment i've got a few really happy so i think that will probably go in the giveaway um yeah i i don't feel like i need that one and I, I want this giveaway to be re I might have to do two boxes because there is so much stuff now. But I want the giveaway to be really good, really, you know, some special things in it. So I think that one might go in it. I know, I know, before anyone says I'm spoilt to be able to do it, I know. But I'm paying it forward because there were times in my life when people were very, very good to me. So I'm paying it forward. Then we're going on to um, the Selfridges box um oh 15 where are you there you are Sat. oh and this has got an ordinary now i like the ordinary products they're really good value um if you go on the ordinary website it seems really confusing when you first go this is not an ad or anything 
<laughs> it seems really confusing when you first go on there but they're very helpful in putting together a little routine and i really do appreciate the ordinary because they keep the print prices very very sensible um, and this is the 100 percent organic cold pressed rose hip seed oil i actually already have a bottle of this and it is really good stuff it's so soothing what do they say i haven't read it for a long time um Apply once a day to the face, ideally at bedtime, absolutely, after application of water-based treatments. And it kind of locks them in. So you, you put on your different serums and things like that that hopefully are water-based. And then you put this oil on the top and it kind of locks them in. It, oh, it's nice stuff. It really is nice stuff. It'll probably go in the giveaway because I do have one on the go and I'd like someone else to have a go of it. Um, but I'm happy to have received that one. That's one I think is worth having. And then finally, of course... The charlotte tilbury uh and we're on day are we on day two we're day... <laughs> yeah day two uh, yes no so we're on day three of charlotte tilbury the third box down and this time i've got oh an easy highlighter called beauty light wand um let's just open this up and just see oh you just pull it oh look it's got a little sponge on that so i presume you squeeze i'm not going to do that and it it fills the sponge and then you can sort of dibby wherever you want that might it might work i don't use highlighter it might work for me i suppose what does it say twist to open and then gently squeeze to release product and then twist to close then apply with the cushion applicator but it's i mean one thing that charlotte tilbury got right was her packaging didn't she get her packaging right it is so luxe looking honestly it could be anything in there but looking as stunning as that you know we all go "Ooh, what is that <laughs> it's the magpie in us ladies um i may actually try that one i may try that one i may not <laughs> whoever wins the box or boxes may find that and go oh i thought she was going to try it i may not i may and i may not because as i say i tend not to use highlighter do I want to try highlights? I don't know. Anyway, that was the Charlotte Tilbury. So that was the four advents for today. As I say, following this now is my um, Lakiro haul. And I, I can't remember whether I said goodbye on it or not. <laughs> so I'm going to say goodbye now again. <laughs> Bye, guys. Hi, guys. Um, today, as my add on, I have my Lakiro box. My name's Fawn. <laughs> This is my happy place. <laughs> I come here to talk to my friends and show them what I've been up to. If you like that kind of thing, please do give me a thumbs up, click subscribe and leave a comment. Now then, as you may or may not know, Lakiro is a box that you order once a month, once a year, whatever suits you. It costs £10 and they send you five items curated by your stylist. If you keep anything, they take the £10 off that, so it will have cost you nothing. If you keep everything that's in the box, you get a 25% discount, which can make it a real bargain. And if you get the right stylist, it can be really exciting too. So here we go. I'm going to show you the five things that I've got. So you open it up and that's what it looks like. You have an envelope um, and in it you have the price list of the items, a oops, fold out card that has images of the items, is that the right, no that way, <laughs> and how you can use them in your existing wardrobe, I spread the word of course, and then you get a letter from your stylist and mine says, hey Fawn, welcome back. I know the last few boxes haven't been perfect, but I'm so glad you haven't hated the pieces. Ha <laughs> ha, let's hope this one is perfect. And then she lists the things, talks about how she visualized you using them and why she put them in the box. I'm not gonna read it all out, it's too long and it gives away the surprise as well, because I love the surprise. Um, so have a lovely day, kissy Sahara. So, Zahara, I think, is an amazing stylist, but like all of us, you know, things go wrong sometimes. So I've got two bundles, and then in the bottom of the box is a prepaid envelope in which you put anything you don't want, seal it up, and take it to a um, <laughs> DP 
PD shop. I was struggling there. Mine is my local uh, Matalan, so it's fine for me. Okay, let's see. Let's dig in. Oh, now I like this straight away. First out is a short sleeved shirt. Now I know some people are going to say short sleeves this time of the year, but I'm a layer girl. I'm a hot girl. I'm wearing short sleeves today because I'm hot. So that is really nice. Um, I like this pattern, this green and black sort of camouflage pattern on it. I hope that one fits. So this one is by um, Maranta. Um, it's a size 48 or 4XL. Fine with me. As long as it fits, fine with me. I don't really care what the numbers say, but that is really pretty. It's a button through suggestion of a sleeve, but not a full sleeve. Keen to try that on. Ooh, this is pretty. Next up is another top. Oh, look how cute that is. White and black. Um, it's by New Atelier. It's got, can you see, it's safari type creatures. So there's leopards and tigers and gazelles and, and all sorts on that. Very simple, round neck, short sleeve, fabulous fabric. That's one of the things I've noticed with Nude Atelier. Their fabrics are great. It's got a sort of a, <clears throat> a ruffle on the bottom of the, of the blouse, which I hope will be kind over my belly. That would be absolutely marvellous if it was. <laughs> Not very comfy. And then last out of this bundle is, oh, it's a cardigan. It's one of these jersey cardigans. I'm not massively keen on them, but they are considerably better for me than a, a wool cardigan because they are thinner and they're not itchy either. So it's just plain black. Um, I can't tell. I think it's just a straight edge front. Um, I don't think it's a waterfall. I, I'm hoping it's not a waterfall because I'm not keen on waterfalls. But that could be a real good sort of walk, walk horse. <laughs> workhorse piece oh I haven't said who buy or the size so this one is by uh, closet by low and it is a size 2 they call it which is a a triple XL last bundle oh I'll bet this is break but yes it is it's break burn I recognize the patterns on this a very nice quite a heavyweight shirt this one I mean, I think it's only cotton, but it's a thick cotton, as opposed to, say, the new Detelier, which is almost like tissue paper. Um, I always love Breakburn's patterns. I think they do very, they're kind of jewelsy, kind of sea salty, that kind of vibe. Um, it's a size 20. So fingers crossed that will work, because that's a really simple, nice blouse. And then last out of the package is a pair of jeans. Oh, I haven't had jeans for a while. Funny enough, I'm on the hunt for jeans. These are Only Karma Coma. Now, my black jeans that I love to death are Only Karma Coma. Uh, Only Karma Coma. They're called the Augusta High Waist Skinny Jean. It's got the full five pockets. Um, they look really nice, actually. And they are a UK 18. It's a nice pair of jeans as well. Oh, it's all separates this month, and I'm excited about all of them. <laughs> so here we go, let's have a go at trying them on. Okay, put the jeans on so that I can try all the other things with it. It seemed logical to me. Um, what would I say about them? They're a bit too skinny, I think. It's causing these wrinkles, these wrinkles all down the legs. Um, and they are, but I mean, all jeans are, are pretty grim here on me. It has to be said. So that's not these particular jeans. But I'm finding the legs a little bit wrinkly. They're the sort of jean that wants to wrinkle up. And they're not particularly long. I don't know. I'm hoping my foot is in here. I usually, my long jeans are longer than this or my short jeans are shorter than this. So I'm not sure about these jeans at all. There's a bit of me that's saying, you know in the new year you're gonna get a few pounds off and maybe just a very few pounds would make these a great pair of jeans because I've been very happy with my black Karma Coma ones. But of course they're all different cuts, aren't they? As for the shirt, I like it. I could wish it was longer at the front so that I would be able to wear it like this, which I wouldn't because this bit is too 
awful for words. I don't want to highlight that. And I think with the top stopping there, it is drawing attention to that, is my opinion. But it's a lovely shirt. It's really roomy, lots of room in this. Very, very comfortable, very, very light. I really like this shirt. I'm going to come in so you can get a better look at it. I mean, I don't know, does it do anything for me? I don't know. I really don't know. Um, I'm not feeling it in this outfit, I must say. But as I say, I just keep thinking these jeans are really comfy. I'm going to keep them on. They're really, really comfy. And if I lost half a stone, they might, you know, they might be amazing. So, ooh. <laughs> the fabric on this is wonderful. Nude Atelier does the, just the gentlest cotton you could ever come across. I love the sleeves. I love the pattern. I am not sure about the cut, ladies. I feel that this is a bit high before the frill. I sort of think it should be a bit lower and then the frill. It's not long enough to hide what's going on here. Um, oh, here's a beautiful top, but maybe not on me. You can see with the jeans. I think it's giving me more bulk here when that area is fairly slim and it's not covering the fat bit, which I would love it to. I mean, if it was down here, I'm just gonna <laughs> bend over and switch. Do you see what I mean? If it was there and then the frill over the bit of me that I really loathe, it would be great, but it isn't, it's up here. So much as I love it, I think this just definitely has to be a no. This shirt, I love. I absolutely love. It's long enough to give me that little bit of um, coverage where I want it most. I also like that it, you know, comes down on the bum as well. Not that that's a big worry area of mine, but you know, I like the fit on it. It's still quite slim fitting, but it's giving me the coverage I want. The sleeves are incredibly long. <laughs> I will say that, the sleeves are incredibly long. So it would have to be worn, rolled up at least a couple of times for my comfort. It's very pretty, it's got this, I think they call it, is it pin tucking? That they, I don't know if that'll even come across, but it's got stitching down the front. I think it's called pin tucking. Um, and I think it'll only look better as I lose more weight. So I really like this. This is, this is a proper, yes, I really like this top. I'll show you from behind. This is cotton, so the fabric is lovely. Um, and I think the colourway is good for me, the navy with a little bit of green, a little bit of pink. So that, that is a yeehaw. <laughs> I put the green shirt back on so I could try the cardigan. I have to say, I don't like it. Um, it's just, it's a nothing cardigan. It doesn't, there are no pockets. It doesn't really add anything. I suppose it adds a layer of warmth. But it just hangs. It's one of those jersey cardigans that just don't have much to say for themselves at all. And I just don't feel is, is my style. Um, I've got much nicer cardigans than this. So, um, yeah, it's just, it's just something and nothing uh, kind of cardigan and not one that I want to spend money on. Okay, so here we go. Well, it's definitely not going to be a five for five. And I'm going to have to have a really big think about all of, well, yeah, the pieces that I did like, whether they're actually worthwhile me getting. So let's just go through them and I'll tell you how much and so on. So first up are the jeans. These are the only Karma Coma jeans. Oops, a daisy. They were £28, which is a good price. Um, and my black coins have worn beautifully. But I was thinking... They are a bit on the short side for what I would want, the way I wear my jeans. Now, maybe that's just because I was a bit, sorry, I've got hair everywhere from pulling things over my head. Maybe that's just because I'm so plumptious at the moment. It's causing them to lift. I don't know, but I'm not sure enough to want to buy them, I don't think. So I'm gonna send them back. I am going to do, I've decided while I was doing this, um, I was thinking about it the other day, I was in Marks and Spencers and I was looking at all their different jeans 
and you know the, all the different fits and, and the ivy and the lily and the mom and the boyfriend and I was thinking well what does that mean for me for my body shape so I'm actually going to buy a pair of each type of jean and do a video and show you what they look like and we'll see <laughs> please god i'll find a fit that is kind kind to an apple lady <laughs> next is the closet by low cardigan i i really didn't like this ladies um i'm just not keen on this style of cardigan these sort of jersey cardigans i'm just not keen on them um and it is closet by low and it is 35 pounds 35 oh 35 90 actually well i would never not not in a million i mean there's sort of a 10 pounds in pre-mark uh sort of look to it i just not me not at all so that will be going back then there is the Maranta top. Now, I have to say, I like this. Um, I wish it was longer, but I do like it. So let's see what the price is on it. The price on it is £40.90. and p. Now, bearing in mind, because I'm not buying all five, I can't get the discount. Would I pay £40 for it? No, I wouldn't. I really wouldn't. Um yes it's a yeah 25 percent discount so normally it would be you know with 25 percent discount it'd be 30 pounds and, and i might think about it at that point but i wouldn't pay 40 so even though i like it oh dear it's going back next is the nude atelier blouse which was absolutely the fabric is gorgeous i think i've said this before with them i'm probably repeating myself the hundred millionth time fabric is fabulous pattern is fabulous but unfortunately in this instance the actual cut is not fabulous on me um and the nude atelier top is 30 38 pounds 90 so yeah it's going back <gasps> this is awful i'm feeling really guilty so the only one that i'm even considering is the break burn shirt um this one is 37 pounds 99p would i pay now i must say the fabric is fabulous the quality the cut was really good i do like the pattern a lot but would i pay 38 pounds 90 <clears throat> this is the one i'm going to have to think about so i'm going to put that to one side because it's not a definite no i'd like it to be a yes but we'll see so let's do the final sums okay the value of the items in the box i'm gonna to have to put my glasses on sorry ladies the value of the items in the box is 181 pounds and 69p now i have a credit on my account at the moment of 24.99 and then I would have a 25% discount and it would round that box down to costing me today £111.28 which I think you will agree if they fitted would be brilliant a pair of jeans a cardigan and three shirts for £111 but unfortunately they don't fit I don't get the discount so um and it's not that they don't fit the style isn't quite suited it's almost but not quite it's it's one of those so I do feel badly for Sahara but she's doing well still <laughs> I'm going to give her a load of feedback on this one I think I don't think I did on the last one I'm going to give her a load of feedback of what I think and um and I'm sure there'll be more five for five boxes coming along soon <laughs> okay <laughs> bye guys